it's time for us to catch the thief. Who is the thief? Apparently, there's like this Robin Hood figure. And Kazuma only accepted this because he realized, hmm, I have an excuse to stick around in this royal capital and get all the luxuries, you know. Sebastian, sorry, what's his name again? Heidel or something, right? Every time, he would just like assault and harass the maids working there. The butlers get all the free food, fuck around with the princess. Very wholesome, right? Iris is very wholesome. It's, it's great. But, you know, we got to go back. And he realizes, shit, if I have an excuse to catch the Robin Hood, then I can stay here. Psych. Where are we going? We're going to this motherfucker's house. Uh, the person that took darkness in season two. And now we got to, like, <laughs> like sleep there and act like we're, like, uh, living there. And then catch the Robin Hood. I don't know. Who's the Robin Hood going to be? I think a popular guess is Eris. Not Eris, actually. Chris, who is the same people, the thief. Let's begin today's reaction. Shut the fuck up, useless bitch! What the fuck, Megumi? These two? Straight up, only showed up for the free food and the banquet. Darkness actually gave a fucking help to us. Megumi and Aqua only showed up for the free food. <laughs> didn't she do some sussy shit to Aqua? Uh, sorry, Darkness? So he actually didn't do anything to Darkness, huh? I mean, in season two, there were some random scenes of Darkness being put into different dresses and stuff. But I guess he never, you know, laid his hands on. Dustin never mind, he's touching her. Gross. Gross! Cosmo's fine with it. I feel like I'm gonna start feeling bad for this guy pretty soon. Because these fucking freaks in our party, they're just gonna treat his house like it's theirs. And he's gonna have to live with it too. Oh no, I kinda- we're gonna start feeling bad for this guy. <laughs> it's basically the saying, right? It's like, I'm not stuck here with you. You're here stuck with me. Divine punishment for this handsome, this handsome gentleman thief. Okay, so the thief can't be Chris then. The thief is like a handsome gentleman? I mean, this place looks pretty cozy too. Wait, wait, wait. What was he doing? He's wiping the mirror, but he's like being... I thought he was like peeking or like hearing girls change or something. Is he just like looking at himself and, and doing that? Is he a narcissist? Does he straight up jack off while looking in the mirror and that's the only way he can nut? Yeah, what's Oi. in that mirror? There's something- Oh, it's a transparent mirror! You motherfucker. Is Kazuma gonna join his side and start doing degenerate shit together? Wait a minute, I don't know. Is he gonna be like, oh, how dare you? Or is he gonna be like, do you need to teach me this? Care to join me? Wait, 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 wait. wait. Yeah, so I can use the mirror by myself. Yeah, of course he will. <laughs> he doesn't want to share the mirror. <laughs> she wiped her back with her bare bosoms. That's a crazy thing to say. Being sexually harassed is part of a maid's job description. Really? It's on the application? We may be two of a kind. Um, um, I feel like they are not the same people, but there definitely is a degenerate side that maybe does align with him. So there is some truth here. Tunku. Tunku? <laughs> Did he take it? Oh, God. Both of you were. Holy. Kazuma and this new noble. I'm kind of digging their vibes together. Enjoying lunch? Good morning. <laughs> Megumi missed Kazuma the most, right? What is this piano thing playing, bro? Is this a ship? Is this a ship? Maybe. Wait a minute. It is a Karakum! What are we doing right now? I mean... The movie, the Crimson movie, was really sussy. 
in like how they were pairing Kazuma and Megumi. The mom, the mom was literally outside the door, just like making sure that no one could leave. Froze that shit and just like, all right, you gotta fucking you know get on with Cosma. Come on, we need to make sure secure the bloodline so we can inherit all the money because she thinks that Cosma's loaded or has a mansion or some shit, right? This actually is a ship. Do I enjoy this ship more than Cosma Darkness? Cosma Darkness, that's already pretty. That's pretty good too, right? Cosma Aqua, fuck no. Cosma and Aqua, I think, are like. Sister brother, bro. It's like, ew, get the fuck away from me. I could never see Aqua like that. Hell fucking no. Union. What about Union, guys? Union? Uh, the, the movie, you know, Union kind of did say, Kazuma, you need, we need to get married. You need to give me the child. But that was kind of a fake news, too. Megumin and Kazuma. Is this the ship? It might be. <laughs> Being so sweet. <laughs> Date? Where? where? Date? Date? That's his second badump today. We're carrying her back. That's what it is. That's so long range though. Holy shit. We're her personal bag carrier and she's the bag. It's gonna just keep shortening the explosion, right? Wait. The mates are getting drunk with Aqua. Okay, this is funny. This is actually funny. There it is. Right, it just keeps getting shorter and shorter. We've done this before. On the right, you see that? Turquoise, greenish blue, I see. Yes. Demon Lord Command is attacking. That is crazy. Each explosion almost is the size. Look at the circumference of this, right? It's actually almost the size of the town here. Like some of the explosions are not as big, but like the top right, top left, like holy fuck. <laughs> okay, Aqua just being an alcoholic. Megumi with Chuni stories. <laughs> I love Hans. Massage where? Is he getting tired of this shit? <laughs> Even Darkness feels so fucking sorry because we're just like, you know, pushing it way too much. Cosmo, Megumi, and Aqua, they're fucking demons here. What'd I say? I, we said we start feeling sorry for this guy. <laughs> The moon is yellow. Chris! Oh, no, it is fucking Chris. I thought the thief was a, fa like a handsome gentleman or something. Wait, 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 wait. Thank you so much, Eris, the goddess of luck. And yes, it's pretty much confirmed that Chris is Eris. Eris is Chris, right? There's many different things. First of all, uh, the fucking Eris pads are fucking titties right chris is flat um if you take out you know fucking ch and put e in front of chris it's, it's just chris right Eris and chris right another thing is um the moment that la latina was worshiping at Eris's church saying i'm so lonely i wish there was someone to hang out with chris showed up out of nowhere and and and, and stuff like this too right oh he's talking about Eris, then fucking chill goes down there. it's it's just confirmed it <laughs> What do you got to? Because I see the pudding. I see the jello going boing boing. Boing boing. It's jiggling. So I think this is alluding to the fact that we are grabbing. Boing boing. But there's nothing there to grab though, remember? She pads her chest. Boing. Boing. The Cosmo has now stolen Chris's panties. Hey, your death to society. Says you. Is that a... Just a guard. Oh no, not another side quest. Shit, no, stop talking. You're the nasty pervert, bro. What, you, what, what are you doing? Alright, bye bye. Maybe he enjoys this. Flat. Tougher than the Demon King General? Whoa. Probably. They won't. 
ねえカズマこんな時になんだけど私あなたに謝りたいことがあるのねカズマが連れ去られてからいつまで経っても帰ってこなかったじゃん yeah, didn't you miss him? What did you find? What did you find? それでねカズマが作りかけてた人形っぽいの doll looking thing doll looking thing doll figurines? Do we have figurines? This isn't Rudy from Mushoku Tensei doll looking thing Do I remember this? Is it a callback from like season 2 content? Figurines? Doll? いやそんなのまた作ればいいんだし早く高速を What is the toy? What is the doll? That's it? Okay, she started drinking. Broke a bunch of other stuff. Okay, what'd you break? Fuck you, you suck. Aqua sucks. Do your fucking party tricks and make me some money in the streets. Wait, did the M just turn into an S? Wait. <laughs> <laughs> They're shoving fucking puddings in his throat while he's tied up. <laughs> Go on, say it. Say how sorry you are being a cocky bastard lately. <laughs> Switch. <laughs> it's possible. <laughs> Megumi's awfully getting turned on by this too. 200. <laughs> Dude, he's gonna fucking kick us out pretty soon. <laughs> Fuck you, Aku. What is that smug fucking slur? <laughs> Yeah, stronger than a demon lord general. We saved Alder. <laughs> We're getting fucking roasted. What? What? Sure, I guess. What? God, this girl, bro. This fucking girl, but we need to steal her. More shua shua. What is the balloons he has? Some dude showed up? Meat. Who ate the meat? Nah, she deserved that shit. Mitsurugi! <laughs> yeah, uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Aqua is the one that gave him Ram, but I guess Aqua sees so many different heroes being reincarnated that they would obviously, he, she would just forget, right? She forgot him in season one, too, right? Cut! <laughs> Oh, Baldi from Class in the Elite? <laughs> Katsuragi, my man, Baldi? Nah, no, 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 no. Mitsurugi! Mitsurugi! <laughs> we sold that shit off. And he got it back, I think. What is his full name? Mitsurugi Kyohei? Mitsurugi something. Kyohei, almost, almost. Kyohei, Kyohei. Oh. What the fuck is that a ring? Is that... Mary? No, no, no. Just a gift. Just a gift. Would she not sell this? Go to a pawn shop. Get more money. Get more shua shua. Ikemen! That's, that's Giguk. That's Giguk in this recent video. Ikemen! Ikemen! Let's sell it. Shua shua. Let's sell it. Three glasses. Mitsuri needs to fucking drink. Oh, it's Chris again. What's up? Last. Okay, I see what the balloons are for. I'm like, they keep bringing back the balloon. What? What is the point of the balloon? You know the jello, the pudding thing that was shaking around while Kazuma was going boing boing, boing boing. So it's the balloon. They always knew. Yes, he has to. You know, he has to grab him. Booty call. Chris booty call. <laughs> we don't want to go on your side quest. Get out of here. Divine treasures. Dark, dark hair, dark eyes, funny sounding name. It sounds almost like this is just for like Megumin's tribe, the Crimson, right? Funny sounding names. Or could it just be Japanese like isekais? Because I guess they kind of have funny sounding names compared to their name. So isekai character probably? Oh! Graham! Graham is a divine relic then, right? Weird one's like yours. Okay, so these are isekai characters. 
Japanese isekai characters. They, they're the ones holding, wielding these divine relics. Oh, wait, even the fucking... Uh, remember when Chris stole the money printing thing in the first episode, right? That's basically another divine artifact, right? Divine thing. So she's basically trying to get rid of, cleanse the world of these OP items that Aqua has given out to people to restore order or some shit. Yes, except Cosmo didn't get one. What is Cosmo's cheat item? It's Aqua. Take Aqua back home. <laughs> just take take Aqua. We'll just offer. Yeah, fucking get her out of here. Or disaster in the case of Aqua. Yeah, she stole that gun. Sorry, the money pop and shit. It's just for fun. We're just printing money. Client is Eris, right? Because she is the client. So Eris, for some reason, she's doing goddess duties. Incredible treasure coming from the castle. Is it Graham? Because Mitsurugi is here today, right? It's got, maybe it's Graham. It is the cursed sword Graham. It's Mitsurugi. He happens to be here. He just happens to show up today too. So maybe this is the re-stealing uh, of Graham. Because we fucked this Graham up in season one. He sold it, right? Then we're going to do it again? Or maybe it's someone else. Maybe it's someone else. It's an either a callback to the gram again or it's something. You know what fashion? Bind! It's, it's like, remember this stuff? The fucking the panty steal? We should bind darkness. Chris, she was just here. What's this alarm? Thief alarm? Different alarm? DB King, okay! Devil King Army alert, who is it? Who's it gonna be this time? Let him sleep. He's, too... <laughs> He's been carrying too hard. Yes, perfect for the person that's taken out previous Demon Lord Generals. Wait, did you just call me mid? Calling me mid would be a compliment, frankly. Mid? Yeah, you have fucking Mitsurugi here too. Low level? Can we take that insult? Mid Zuma. Mid Gumin. Dark mid. Mid Kwa. Aqua is actually the most important when fighting the Devil King army though. The holy counter, it's too OP. Okay, maybe she'll just solo it. Dude, our party is actually fucking ridiculous. We really need Kazuma to be the glue. True. Then we get the favor of the royals. And then we get another reason to stay here and fuck around with Iris. All right, we're back. Because, like, she keeps saying, like, there's, like, OP adventures here that we can kind of rely on. But maybe we're getting fucking set up. I don't fucking know. I feel like there's not going to be any OP. Decent enough show. Just go there. Just do a little Soga King. And then we get in. Just one breakfast sausage? All right, he's showing up soon. He's showing up soon. There he is. The hero arrives late. The hero. <laughs> Only when it favors him, he'll look cool. We got an entire army there too, man. Things should be good. And that's the episode. I think that we're getting baited as usual whenever Kazuma keeps saying stuff like, oh yeah, there's an OP, you know, adventurous here. Surely we just got to put on a little show and we'll get carried. Ain't no fucking way. There is a huge army out here though, right? There was a huge army there. But I just feel like we're getting baited as usual and something really hilarious will happen next episode. A new Demon Lord General show up. Maybe it's an existing one. I do want to see Megman's new, you know, powers too. And maybe Cosmo will get the favor of the nobles after he defeats whatever, you know, the X amount of fucking Demon General it is now. The other stuff today was just kind of like... This... Al Albert? Al Derp. You know what? Fuck him? But also, he makes for pretty good content. And something about Alderp and Kazuma kind of being same in their degenerate ways, like, I swear to God, the author is kind of saying like, yeah, like, they're not the same, but there is a side to them, they kind of align. So whenever he was like, you're like me, aren't you? And I'm like, kind of true, kind of fucking true. Alderp, I was kind of mean on him the past couple episodes, even last season, because he took darkness, right? But if you really think about it, 
his house got blown up due to the bullshit that, you know, Kazuma was doing in, in, in season one at the end, right? With the fucking destroyer and we ported the random place and his house got fucked up. And now his house is getting more fucked up because, you know, Aqua, Megumin, Kazuma, Darkness, they're all just fucking here making themselves too, you know, easy at home. Aqua and Eris. Aqua and fucking Megumin, though. They're just always here just for their free food and nothing else, bro. I, Darkness actually is doing the bulk of the work trying to, like, babysit them, right? Mitsurugi being here makes me think that Chris is a divine item that she's looking for is holy sorry curse sword Graham it's gotta be right he's the other isekai character in here maybe there's another character in here but most likely it's Graham why is she collecting it probably just like goddess duty it's just to kind of restore the balance of the world we can't have too many OP cheat weapons right probably some kind of orders from above but that's it from me if you're still here if you enjoyed this reaction please like the video check out the other playlist for more content and until next time take care